get feedback from you asking how Mayor Tony Arbor plans to address the problems plaguing the capital city. Tonight, he's answering some of those questions in 16 WAPT's Ask the Mayor segment. How in the world are you going to get the Jackson cleaned up and the killing every day? What's wrong with that? Why you can't clean up the killing? You want to clean up somebody's yard? Why you can't clean up all this killing out here every night? I wish I could clean up uh, killing. I wish we could stop it. I don't think that there's anyone in the city of Jackson who goes to sleep or wakes up in the morning uh, excited about uh, people's lives being taken. And so we need your help. We need you engaged. We need your civic organization, uh, the church that you belong to, participating in this process of helping to restore the moral fabric in our community. Uh, beyond that, uh, high visibility from our police department is something that we pledge. It's something that you should be seeing. And if not, uh, we encourage you to attend your local cops meeting. If you're in Precinct 1, they happen every Thursday, uh, first Thursday of the month, Precinct 2, every second Thursday, Precinct 3, Precinct 4, respectively, uh, at 6 o'clock. We encourage you to plug in and get engaged in helping us to solve this crime. I remember when he said that when he got in office, the first thing he was going to do was try to fix these streets. These streets are a mess, and Jackson does not want to pay us if they tear up our ties and our cars. Well, uh, I hate, hate that you feel that way. Um, I don't know if you've had an opportunity to see uh, the pothole blitz that we've launched. Uh, we've probably um, covered almost about 3,000 potholes during the time that we've done this. Uh, that is our um, short-term plan. Long-term is 1% sales tax money that you have uh, voted for. We anticipate being able to start spending that money in the next several months. Uh, we put together the commission. Uh, we've started to put together the plan that will help you see the improvements that you've talked about. My commitment was solid, and you'll see that happen uh, within the next year to see road and, more importantly, infrastructure repairs happening in our city.